Hello, welcome back to my channel and today we are playing uh, Back to the Future episode 3 part 1 Well, let's do this shit, Citizen Brown. Sorry, I should have put the subtitle. Wait. Okay then. Escape from the crash. Time machine. So. Oh, we got that kit. Then flask. This is the dumbest design ever. Ah, uh, hello. She can't hear me. I know. Don't worry, everybody. I'm okay. The billboard broke my fall. Just gonna try to horn. What the hell? Hey, could you give me a Jennifer? That's Jennifer with the crazy gra graphic. I'm sorry, I didn't. I, I couldn't recognize. C congratulations. Uh, yeah, throw kit and splash. Jennifer! Look at this! What? You carry your apple juice in a flask now? <laughs> God, what a dork. A uh, horn. Door. <clears throat> it's jammed. Okay then. Window. It's already open. It's gonna throw him a photo off. I don't think that would look good there. I better not. This could be the only printing left in existence. Jennifer, I need some help. Martin? It is you. Is that a DeLorean? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It is a DeLorean. Uh, well, yeah, it's a DeLorean. What else would it be? How the hell did it get into the billboard like that? Uh, never mind that. Just give me a hand, okay? <laughs> a son of a bitch. So who are you supposed to be? Luke or Bo? This isn't funny, Jennifer. Oh, Luke Skywalker? Okay, uh, what's the date? What? Yeah, what's the date? Oh man, what's the date? What? That's something I should be asking you. You've probably wrecked your head. Just, what's the date, Jennifer? It's the 15th. The year? 1986, duh. Oh man, oh man, this can't be happening. Uh... Help me down, just help me you down. Help me down? Why don't you just jump? I'll break my neck. And? Could you call someone? A tow truck, maybe. Get real. I'm in enough trouble already. I'm not going to explain your DeLorean violating a billboard to anyone. The door's jammed. Can you get it open? I can't reach it. Besides, I'm not climbing under the car. It could come down on my head. Yeah, that, you got that, any rope you can toss me? Uh-uh. All I have is this rusty wrench thing I found in the dirt. A tow truck? 
tire iron. I think that'll do. Toss it here. Oh, back off, Martin. This is my witch, Macaulay. What do you give me for it? May I please have the tire iron? The tire who? The big metal thing you're holding. Oh, right. As soon as you offer up a decent trade. Oh. Uh, you're being such a f fucking geek. All right, let okay. me think this through. Okay. Don't strain your brain, Geekzilla. God damn it. You're supposed to be my girl, man. Okay, we'll throw you some. Jennifer! This is all I got. Is there anything in it? Yeah, booze. Give me here. Ugh. It smells like armpits and booze. Irving Kid Tannen, the gangster? Where the hell did you get this? It's a long story. Can I just have the tire iron now? Heads up! Thanks! Oh, nice catch. Oh, great. Now what? Oops. Oh. Well, your dorkness, my debt to society is paid. As for you, good luck with your car. Way to stick it to Big Brother. Just don't expect your sudden cry for attention to change anything between us, dig? It doesn't change what? Look, Jennifer, I think there are some things... We gotta check something. Okay then, the thing's checked. We need to talk about it. <laughs> check the yeah, maybe audio. You can give me a lift in the town. Oh, sure, Martin. Climb on in. Sorry about that. Jennifer, wait! I told you, we're through, McFly. I'll never date such a square again. My own girlfriend thinks I'm a square? Holy shit. Jesus, could this get any worse? Whoa, whoa, whoa! And the time machine broke. Doc, I could really use your help right about now. Relax! We've got everything under control. Okay then. I could use the tire though. Okay, good. This could be useful. Now think, Marty, think. Well, now that it's off the car, it looks like the power cables for the hover system have disconnected. It's dead. May 15th, 1986. Yeah, the, the date's right, but... Well, that's not good. Now that it's off the car, it looks like the Carl Sagan escape. It's better. Uh, check, check. Sibilance, sibilance. Who is this? Stop messing with the intercom. Oh, ha <laughs> ha, hi. Can you buzz me in? Visitors must check in at the North Gate. Oh, North Gate? I'm not walking clear around Hill Valley. There's got to be another way. I don't know. There's, some, there's, some, there's nothing in the trash. Subtle. Real subtle, Marty. Let's check the DeLorean again. Maybe something that we can use. Oh, Mr. Diffusion, Mr. Fusion. I'm gonna check Mr. Fusion. I don't really feel qualified to repair a nuclear reactor. Maybe it's still under warranty. Well, I guess technically it's way under warranty. And 
This is the second time I've completely destroyed Doc's time machine. I just shouldn't be allowed to drive it anymore. I don't think that's gonna buff out. I hope there's something salvageable here. I don't think that's gonna buff out. Well, now that it's off the car, it looks like the power cables for the hover system have disconnected. I know. So? There's nothing here that I can use. Oh, is it? How the hell do you get through these? There's a security camera. The battery, okay, okay. There's something, no. So batteries. 12 volts. Wait, this is the car battery? It must have been installed in 2015 with the Mr. Fusion. Still has plenty of juice. Only one. Let's connect the battery to the wheel. Let's see here. Red to positive, black to negative. Far out. Okay, Doc, let's see what kind of nightmare alternate timeline I've landed in this time. Okay, Marty. Nothing to be afraid of. It's just an alternate hill valley that's turned my girlfriend into a punk rock vandal. That doesn't mean it's full of post-apocalyptic biker gangs <laughs> run by armies of Biff clones. Just take a deep breath and remember, we gotta find Doc. So, so clean. Yeah, they tend to do that. Citizen? Good morning to you too, citizen. All citizens pay. What's going on here, Doc? It feels like Jeez, Wolfenstein. My Hill Valley never looked this good. It feels like Wolfenstein, the new order, you know, the super concrete. Mm. Watch where you're going, citizen. Sorry. Uh, Mr. Parker. That's Officer Parker to you, Martin. 
Now what's with the outfit? I, uh... It's Thursday. Yeah? Polo shirt Thursday. You're out of uniform. That's a violation of Civic Ordinance 9 Triple E. And you're not wearing an ID in direct violation of Ordinance WB714. What are you up to, citizen? Polo shirt? Are you on the pot, citizen? Put your arms up. Spread your legs. Hey, what are you doing? Quiet. Hold still. Hmm. Nothing. What's your deal today, McFly? Uh, can you tell me where I could find Doc, uh, Citizen Brown? Are you sure you're an honor student? Where do you think he is at this time of day? At work? That's right. At work. Working at the courthouse. Oh, no. Heavy. Have you seen Jennifer? What's it to you? I thought she broke up with you. Yeah, well, I need to talk to her about that. Good luck finding her. I usually don't see her unless she's racking up demerits for her art. Can I have you seen Jennifer? Okay, okay, it's the what? same fucking yeah, thing. Well. Good luck. Okay, what's with the pat down, man? Hey, what's with the pat down? What do you think? I'm packing heat? Heat? Contraband? Contraband? You know. Booze, smokes, bubblegum, dogs, circus bubble gum peanuts. Is illegal. Come on, McFly. You're smart enough to know that ignorance of the Civic Ordinance 2XM isn't an excuse. Well, is it, is it, did he just say dog? It must be Edna because of Edna. Since when are you a cop? I thought you were a shoe salesman. Are you on something? I've always been a cop. Just like my pa. Great. I've turned my girlfriend's dad into a cop. Good. Oh no. Okay. I've got to finish my beat. Are you going to make trouble for me today? No, no, no. No, no what? No, sir. That's right, citizen. She had the game stuff for a while. Oh, something on my hand. You are standing in front of the Hill Valley Courthouse. The original courthouse was built in 1885, just 20 years after Hill Valley's incorporation into the state of California. Though the courthouse holds the seat of the local government, it also has been used as a shelter during the recovery period following the 1906 San Francisco earthquake. Most of Hill Valley's community is a result of displaced San Franciscans planting roots after that dreadful disaster. In 1976, the downtown renovation project saw the first major additions made to the courthouse since its original construction. The courthouse was expanded with an additional 128 offices in the new flanking wings and a new mayoral office added to the original clock tower space. Look closely and you can still see some of the original courthouse's details preserved in the new international inspired facade. That's a long, long self tour, man. Valley Courthouse. How may I help you, citizen? I need to see Doc, or, uh, Citizen Brown. Do you have an appointment? Yes. No, but... Then I'm afraid you'll have to wait your turn. Citizen Brown's a very busy man. That voice sounds familiar. Oh no, Biff! Holy Biff? shit, Biff! Doc? Doc, wait! I need to talk to you! Citizen Reading Room Emmett Brown Industries 
Stemley Staycations. What the hell is this? Stemley's Staycation. Stemley's. What the heck is a staycation? Vacation and stay. There's supposed to be a theater over there. Soup mall. Up to lunch. Discipline. Bureau of Discipline. Holy shit. Is you oh. Look at this. Amazing detail for the CCTV. Hey, can't you read? Oh, it's you, McFly. Needles? Leech? Hey, hey, my bad. I should have wrote the sign in Latin, just so you'd understand. What sign? Outway to Unchle. Now eat it, bay, and let me catch some Z's. Okay then. Free soy dog samples, take one. Free soy dog samples, take one. Hmm, I guess they ran out. Soup Mo's menu. Gotta check the park. Biff? Hey, you're you're George and Lorraine's youngest. Martin, right? What? You don't know me? Only by reputation. Brown Cadet of the Month, three months running. What Impressive. Are you interested in the Citizen Plus program? Uh what is this Citizen Plus? It's Citizen Brown's new re-education program, and I'm the first of Hill Valley's Citizen Plus. Uh, pluses. Plus I? A re-education program? What the hell? Please don't swear, Martin. It makes me uncomfortable. Biff, uncomfortable for swearing, okay. Listen, Biff, Let's that do. car I saw you get out of, was that Doc Brown in there with you? Ha! Ah, Doc! That should be his new nickname! But yeah, that was Citizen Brown. What an inspirational guy. How'd you get FaceTime with him? He seems so busy. You got that right, Martin. Citizen Brown's a busy, busy guy. But fortunately, uh, unfortunately, I'm a special case. See, Martin, I used to be a real bad apple. A real butthead. butthead. Yeah. You. You a butthead? No. What can I say, Martin? I was always getting into trouble. Too much trouble, what with the booze, the partying, the women. Even my dogs were a pack of trouble. Pack, get it? Uh, yeah. What does this have to do with Citizen Brown? Well, after getting in so much trouble, the authorities, they took me in to see Citizen Brown and gave me an ultimatum. Citizen Plus or Bust. Do you think I could get to see Citizen Brown if I did all the bad stuff you used to do? I guess, but why would you want to act like that? So you won't break any rules anymore? Can't. The Citizen Plus treatment makes it physically impossible for me to break rules. How so? Now I get physically ill if I try to break oh. a rule. Holy shit. How's your re-education holding up? Still incapable and uninterested in breaking the rules. Sure you aren't craving a beer? I do kind of miss beer. Uh, on second thought, blah! You used to be a real bruiser. That's all behind me now. So what, you wouldn't even defend yourself? I don't know if I could, actually. Wuss. Oh, you're just aching to find out, though. D don't torment me. I can get used to this. Please, Martin, don't make me angry. All right, Biff, you're off the hook this time. I can get used to this. Okay, it's just repeating. Repeating the same fucking thing, okay? So, uh, about... Gosh, Martin. I really don't like dredging up the past, but all right, if it'll help you make a decision about Citizen Plus. 
you said something about booze? Beer, rum, whiskey, wine coolers, you name it, I drank it. Not only did I drink it, I smuggled it into Hill Valley, too. Chip off the old block, huh? Used to be I'd knock your block off for a comment like that. But yeah, I guess I was following in Pop's crummy footsteps. So there's no booze in Hill Valley? Nope. Sure, someone tries to sneak some in every now and then, but cops like Officer Parker over there always catch them sooner or later. Why'd your dogs get you in trouble? You weren't running dog fights, were you? No, nothing that bad. I just used to have a lot of dogs. What's wrong with that? Nothing, other than them keeping the neighbors up all night, lunging at old people, and eating all the squirrels in the park. In fact, I'm ashamed to say it was my out-of-control dogs that were directly responsible for the banning of dogs throughout Hill Valley. You don't sound very ashamed. Oh, I am. Very, very ashamed. What kind of trouble did you get into with women? They weren't hookers? No, no, nothing like that. It's just that I wasn't always discreet about my affections. What? Public displays of affection, Martin. You know, necking and such. That's illegal? Oh, yeah. You seriously got in trouble for PDAs? You bet. The Browns always say that behaviors that excite your privates should be kept in private. <laughs> or maybe it's just Citizen Edna who says that. Oh, fuck. So there's no dogs in Hill Valley anymore? Yep. Citizen Edna says they carry diseases and steal shoes. Yep, I've heard enough. Yeah, let's, let's change the subject. Thanks. I don't like talking about my old nasty self. Nice clothes. You lose a bet or something? What do you mean? I'm wearing what everyone's wearing. It's Polo Shirt Thursday. You, my friend, are out of uniform. So I've heard. Yeah. Well, there's always tomorrow. Hawaiian Shirt Friday. God damn it. This, Great. That's gonna be... That's gonna be like hideous, hideous fucking... Oh, shit. See you later, Biff. Bye, Martin. Oh, that's Jennifer. What's Jen up to now? It's a metal case. The bullet case. But. Well, that's it for today's video. And uh, as I, I hope you guys enjoyed the, the, the watch time. Like 20 minutes. Okay, thank you for watching me playing this game. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.